as was annual mid-year forum on April 30th in Chicago, features great presenters on timely topics like alternative fuels, not getting lazy about safety, and understanding the many benefits of telematics. We have um, a session titled, What the Heck is Telematics? And that title stemmed from um, the amount of emails and, and contacts fleet managers have received regarding telematics. You know, it's, it's obvious for a delivery company what telematics is or a service company, but for the corporate fleet manager has a sales fleet, um, they're really not certain what does telematics mean for me? Well, what is it? What is all this stuff? Uh, and, and how does it pertain to my fleet? And that's how we kind of came up with this title of, you know, what the heck is telematics? Because, you know, you have a lot of people, you ask them, and they're scratching their head and say, I don't know, I don't need it for my fleet. Or do I need it for my fleet? I don't know. So it gives an opportunity for the fleet manager to sit there and, and hear exactly how telematics may be beneficial for their fleet or how maybe they should be looking at telematics rather than just dismissing it as something for the service or delivery type fleet. Um, we have a session on uh, driver safety and these sessions all stem from uh, feedback from our members. We ask them, you know, what's interesting you? What, what is out there that you need to know more about? And from those responses is how we kind of came up with these different topics. Uh, we have a session on safety, um, talking about how the different safety features in cars have made drivers maybe somewhat lazy and not doing their due diligence. You still need to have a safe driver behind the wheel. You could put all the features you want in a car, but you still have to have that person behind the wheel being a safe and trained driver. And so uh, Phil Moser from Advanced Driver Training Services will be uh, speaking to that effect, how people, you know, forget to look behind them now because they're so used to having cameras in front of them when they back up or, or lane departure warnings, you know, people forget to look over their shoulder. The bottom line is you still need to have your driver trained on how to drive uh, safely. Um, Alternate fuels is another topic we're going to be talking about. Despite the drop in gas prices, there still is a lot of interest within corporations, green initiatives uh, to reduce uh, fuel, fossil fuel consumption. And we will have a speaker discussing what's out there, what the trends are, uh, what you look forward to, and again, how that may apply to your fleet you know, down the road as you may want to look to moving to an alternate fuel vehicle.